okay. Um, today, I've got to finish a job off I started the other day on a trailer rear steer. The locking chamber that locks the rear steer up when it's in reverse. Uh, I decided to break a couple of bolts off, uh, kick itself over, which obviously stopped the pin from coming down. So I've managed to smash the old chamber off basically, re-drill all the holes out. Uh, so now I've just got to thread the holes back up. Probably elongate the holes in the new chamber slightly because my holes are slightly off centre, but uh, and then put some bigger bolts in to hopefully stop that from happening again. Uh, like I said, I already started it, so you're not going to see start to finish. I have got something to open today. Uh, cold weather's coming. I don't like the cold. I like to keep warm, so. If there's anything out there that can keep you warm or help us lads out that are out on the road, well, out on sites anyway, working, um, I'm over, obviously always up for that. So I'll uh, we'll open that up in a little bit and we'll try it out, see what we think. Uh, I'm at 900 and something subscribers now, 989, I think it is. Yeah, 989. They were close to a thousand. Um, all I need now is to get more content out there, get you guys to watch it, get the hours in. As soon as them hours have reached four thousand, um, I can hope for them become a partner. I'll get monetized anyway, and then uh, we'll see how we get on. And let's push for it. And then you like here, rocks in the background. Snoring her head off already. Alright, got myself under this trailer. Just thought I'd give you a quick look into what we've got. Show you. This is a new chamber. Basically, has one air supply to it. Air goes in there, sucks the uh, pin up. That's the rear steer turn. And that's the pin that basically locks the axle. And then, that's the issue we've got. It pulled out them two bolts there. So it cockled over and then stopped the pin from locating straight through the hole to lock the axle up. So I drilled them out. I've got that one still to drill out. It's been a nightmare. I'll say thread them up, put a new chamber on, and it should be as easy as that. Let's see how we get on. Milwaukee. Can't beat Milwaukee. I do love a Milwaukee tool. If anybody is looking for tools, Jefferson, very cheap, but I don't ever really have a problem with them. They've been a fantastic make, and you don't mind paying their prices, because if you lose them, you buy another set. Right, got them holes drilled out. Got them tapped out. I sprayed some cutting oil on to obviously help thread them. So, like I said, I know I didn't get them all square on, so 
I'm going to try and drill these out slightly bigger just to give my bolts a bit of a fighting chance to get in. Let's go ahead and do it. Look at the mess I made in my van. Don't worry. I've got just the tool. Roxy! What are you doing? What are you doing? Hello! Hello! What are you doing? Huh? What are you doing? See you. I see you. Hello. Hello. <laughs> what are you doing? What are you doing? Hey. Eh? Good girl. Good girl. Alright, here we go, guys. So, managed to get the bolts back in we were a little bit tight, I had to give it a bit of a wiggle but they've gone in obviously pipe's back on but now as you can see the pin comes straight through the axle so another job done let's cut tools and wrap up Ugh. look this is why I wear gloves because I can now jump into my own van and not get everything black. Gloves and overalls keeps us all nice and clean. It's time to show you all what I'm treating myself to. Are we all ready? Are we okay? I am trying out. A heated all day. No light keeping warm. Heated or heated. Let me in. Look at that. Let me in. Look at that. Full zip, 
That's useful. Controls. And I believe the battery sits in here. What have we got? Oh, it's a battery charger. We don't need that. I've got my walkie chargers. Oh no, it's not. I do need it. That's what the battery sits in. It feels nice. Right. Time to stick it on. I think I could almost go over small actually. Oh. Now the battery itself sits in here and to be honest not too bad. I've got a snap on one. It sits on your ass. And when you're laid on the floor, I can get in the way of that. All right. Starting off on the low setting. We'll see how warm I get. Review it again later in about, what, what should we give it? A couple hours time. See how good the battery goes. And see how warm I feel. Quality feels perfect. Very well made. Okay. I'm after a sponsor. Just remember. Alright, I'm out on this Volvo. Volvo FH. We had a water leak. I forgot to go grab my phone. But uh, basically, we had a water leak in this corner. And I'll put it down to this. I don't know if you're going to be able to see it though. This clip here, as you can see just there, it's opened up. Oh, there in the light. See the crack? And that goes just in there. It's the water pipes to the matrix. There's the pipe, just there. So I took that clip off. All I'm thinking of doing is sliding the pipe straight on, jubilee it on as a temp repair and then get myself a new plug. I'm just going to clean that pipe up and see how we get on. Just got that Volvo done. He's uh, on his way out now. Driver was in a bit of a rush, so and I don't think he really wanted to be on camera. But basically, all I did clean that pipe up, um, steel pipe. Managed to push the rubber pipe back on and uh, duplicate it back up. We topped it with water, gave it a quick run up. Absolutely fine. So that's a nice temporary fit. Well, it could be a permanent fix to be honest, but I might see about getting one of the new clips. I don't know, plastic clips, hot water, you know what it's like. Um, so that's me done for today. I'm off home now. Uh, and that's it. So I'll catch you all later. Thanks for watching and uh, speak to you soon. Just before I go, I've just been watching Chris's new video uh, on his MOT, last minute MOT. Chris. You had me in absolute stitches when you was trying to get that wire on that side, on that top marker. I have not laughed like that for a while. Bloody hell, what are you like? You should have just rang me. You know where I am, just get phone call away. I would have come and dug you out of that one. Um, but no, 
great content as usual. Right guys, I've had this Milwaukee uh, hoodie on all day. Still got battery left, which is very impressive. And to be honest, it has kept me warm. Everybody who have been stood around outside have been saying how cold it is. And I've actually felt warm. So Milwaukee, another top product. That's all I can say, another top product. I'm here if you want a sponsor. Thank you. <laughs> Catch you all again.